After violence shook the community, a local nonprofit hosted its first ever teen hangout, giving teens an opportunity to gather in a safe space. Two News reporter Grace Hewitt joins me live in the studio after talking with teens and club employees on the issues of teen violence and what could be done to solve it, Grace. With more than a handful of teens being involved in the recent surge in gun violence, the Boys and Girls Club of Dayton is rising to the occasion, offering an open, safe and fun space. We definitely just need to stand together as a community to bring more peace. Since mid-June, the Dayton area has experienced 13 shootings, even a couple within a 72-hour period. The Dayton Boys and Girls Club is among the long list of community members looking to spark change. The teen hangout allows teens 13 to 18 years old to meet with licensed therapists, meet new people, and hang out and have fun. With the spark in recent youth violence, um, we just wanted to make sure that the teens in the community, in the broader community, know and understand that Boys and Girls Clubs of Dayton is um, here for them. There are people here in this community who are committed to your well-being, committed to you growing and being a um, positive, caring, and responsible adult. Over 50 teens were in attendance for both days, such as 15-year-old Olivia Mackey, and 17-year-old Kimaya Lamb, who have been involved in the club for some time. They say to see the violence, it's disheartening, but getting involved is a great step in the right direction. There shouldn't be all of this violence at such a young age. Kids should not be dying at such a young age when they have their whole life ahead of them and they don't get a chance to live it. That's very sad. Some teens don't really get the opportunity to go somewhere and have fun because, you know, they might not have a ride or anything like that, but they could get to come here and have fun, get to learn new people, they get also get to talk to people. And besides offering a safe place away from the violence, the Boys and Girls Club is ensuring teens can also get mental health resources if they need. It is okay to let someone know that you're not okay. So we have a saying that we stick together and everybody belongs. So if it's not myself, other um, they know that other staff are here, that they can be a listening ear. And the Boys and Girls Club of Dayton is always looking for volunteers. For information on how you can get involved, head to our website at WDTN.com and look for this story. Live in studio, Grace Hewitt, 2 News.